number 16, a particular verse out of 16, but the main verse is chapter 17. Praise the name of the Lord. Verse 11 to verse 13. Go ahead. And Samuel said unto Jesse, Are here all thy children? And he said, There remaineth yet the young guest, and behold, he keepeth the sheep. And Samuel said unto Jesse, Send and fetch him, for we will not sit down till he come hither. And he sent and brought him in. Now he was ruddy, and withal of all beauty, and withal of a beautiful countenance, and goodly to look to. And the Lord said, Arise, anoint him, for this is he. Then Samuel took the the horn of oil and anointed him in the midst of his brethren and the spirit of the Lord came upon David from that day forward so Samuel rose up and went to Ramah praise God chapter 17 verse 33 to 36. And Saul said to David, Thou art not able to go against this Philistine to fight with him, for thou art but a youth, and he a man of war from his youth. And David said unto Saul, Thy servant kept his father's sheep, and there came a lion and a bear, and took a lamb out of the flock. And I went out after him, and smote him, and delivered it out of his mouth. And when he arose against me, I caught him by his beard, and smote him, and slew him. Thy servant slew both the lion and the bear, and this uncircumcised Philistine shall be as one of them, seeing he hath defied the armies of the living God. Verse 54. And David took the head of the Philistine and brought it to Jerusalem, but he put his armor in his tent. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for your kindness. Thank you for your grace, mercy towards us. Thank you for deliverance. Thank you for signs and wonders. Let your will be done. In Jesus' name we pray. Take your seat with a praise. Hallelujah. I saw the praise God. Hallelujah. The Lord. to many people ever since we knew him to be Christ the son of the living God spoke to Elijah spoke to Moses spoke to a few and a particular writer says that when he speaks, he releases my troubled mind. That's right. And the word of the Lord says that 
Israel wanted a king. Hallelujah, church. And because they wanted a king, they voted for a king. In other words, they called for an election. And they voted for somebody who God does not approve. Saul. The word of God says that God did not approve Saul. But because he gave mankind dominion over the earth, Man will choose whoever they want to choose to rule them. As a matter of fact, the last time I checked, even though he did not approve it, but the word of God says, the government shall be upon his shoulder. Where there is a government, there must be a opposition. The Father, the kingdom of heaven, the whole kingdom is known to be called the government. The opposition is Satan and his army. That's not Where there is an opposition, it simply means that they will oppose on something. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. That has been approved or spoken by the present government. Just like JLP and B. MP. The opposition is the PMP and the government is the JLP. Some of you are looking at me like you're ready for kid with a hundred. Praise the name of the Lord Jesus. I see some of you looking at me like you're saying, I'm so going to send a broken prime minister, bro God. You're your bro God, gentlemen. <laughs> But however, praise the name of the Lord, they will oppose that which the government approves. The word of God says that because the people approved Saul, God, in other words, said, okay, then, so because the people are thirsty the people amen praise God are determined the people amen praise God need somebody they don't need a prophet they don't need a spiritualist they don't need somebody who can bring forth truth they just need somebody in those days praise God they will select you based on your status they will select you based on your height they will select you praise God based amen praise the name of Jesus how you speak based on how you act based on how you dress they will select you and even in today's churches as for so many of us if you are not multi-millionaire hallelujah hallelujah nobody not looking at you they select you because you got money they select you because you can drive a bench they select you because they can make a phone call and say I need 20 million in my account 
and they wire it, amen, praise God, to their account. They selected you, amen, praise God, because you look like a shutter. Somebody praise the name of Jesus. And that's how they selected you. Back then, praise the name of the Lord, glory be to God. But if I could go back to the former, 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 former church. The former church, I think I said that on Sunday morning. That before you get selected or ordained by God, the mothers of Zion have to approve it. It's either they stomp their feet or they make a sound. If the sound that comes from their diaphragm don't sound right, then you are not the one to be the next pastor. Somebody shout out. And then the Bible says, Amen, praise God, that uh, they selected Saul. They selected him maybe because he was from a wealthy background. They selected him maybe because, Amen, praise God, it's a traditional thing. Where one uncle die, and if there is no other brother or is if there is no other children for that uncle, then the nephew who is a man will take the throne they selected you like Queen Elizabeth they have different names but they stick to one name because it is a traditional thing somebody praise God Queen Elizabeth the second Queen Elizabeth the third Queen Elizabeth Queen Elizabeth Queen Elizabeth because it is a traditional thing but on the other hand somebody said on the other hand God did not satisfy and even though God did not satisfy God said you know what I'm going to work with Saul I'm going to work with Saul because the people choose him and at the end of the day the government fell upon my shoulder see in other words who you don't like to be in parliament whoever God placed to be in parliament that is his decision and praise God in here and the Bible said amen praise God that although Saul was chosen by men and by men's choices glory to God God was about to work with Saul for just a moment and the Bible said amen praise God that the Lord gave Saul a specific instruction you see you, you might be not qualified for the post but, but, but because you're not qualified for the post uh, because the people selected you God will work with you that doesn't mean it's a long time period it can be for a moment or for a season when that moment and that season come your time is expired can I take my time like a few cards and the Bible said that he gave Saul a specific instruction and the specific instruction that he told Saul to do Saul go down to Amalek oh I feel glory coming on me go down to Amalek and kill everything in Amalek kill the Amalekites kill Amalek kill the baby kill the wife kill the husband kill every single thing uh, kill out everything kill the camel kill the horse kill the pig every god thing need to die and the last thing God said to Saul anything you see Mantle it. The Lord said to Saul, even if you see gold and silver, destroy it. Get rid of the Amalekites. But the Bible 
Bible said somebody said the Bible said put your neighbor and say neighbor the Bible said that Saul went down to the Amalekites kill a few of the Amalekites but when he reached to a certain stage he saw the gold and the silver and become red eye you're not talking to me over here and he become jealous that he said to himself I will just kill the baby kill out some of the Amalekites but I'm gonna leave the gold and the silver touch your neighbor and say neighbor when God gave you an instruction you must follow instruction so because Saul went down to the Amalekites and left the gold and the silver and the bronze the Lord said I rejected Saul because Saul is disobedient and the Lord visited Hannah baby by the name of Samuel and said Samuel since I gave Saul a specific instruction and he disobeyed my instruction I want you to find me a king find me a king touch your neighbor and say neighbor it's my time I'm getting ready to move from the back to the front you're not talking to me in the house somebody come and blaze with it some fire Oh my 
my Lord. I feel like I'm preaching, like a Baptist preacher. Somebody praise God. Somebody said the blood that Jesus shed for me way back. You're not talking to me. Somebody gonna make up your feelings like when donkey. I'm not going to share. I don't care. Can I tell you? If you don't love my message, cut I cut I Somebody praise God. I feel not at all. So the Lord said, Go to my Jesse house. Tell Jesse. Somebody said, Preach the man. Somebody said, Preach. She preach more. Go down to Jesse. Tell Jesse. Find me a king. Jesse said, I have a first born. Full of muscle. But I hear Holy Ghost say, Samson, or Samuel rather, look not on their side. Hallelujah. Samuel said, the Lord said, not this one, is there not another? Samuel said, I have a second child. Somebody praise God. Samuel said, not sure. Jesse said, I have another one. Samuel said, not sure. But the Bible said that Samuel said to Jesse, is there not another? Somebody say, is there not another? Somebody praise God. Worship him. Jesse said, may have one, we'll take care of sheep. Jesse said, go for him. The Bible said, that when, hallelujah, David came, the heart started to trim. Son of Messiah, can I put this in, in this season, when God anoints you, when the enemy see you. Somebody in this time, this time, you're an enemy. 
say it. Come, come, come. That the horn was trembling. Mm -hmm. And David, I forgot to say long story short. There was noise in the ear. Noise. Feet stomping. Body rocking. I want to kind of show that somebody's a neighbor. I'm told this is a neighbor. I want to kind of show that I see the sound of the enemy. Might sound like you got power, but I hear the Bible say those that are with us are more than those that are against us. Now watch the Lord. Now watch how them shot, shot them shot too much. Them only can shot, but them can't defend it. Some of the praise God, some pray in his there. Let me go to King, King Saul. Go to King Saul, Saul King Saul. Somebody praise God. Said to King Saul, what kind of nice? Somebody praise God. 
slingshot. Give me my handbag. Somebody praise God. The scene I was telling. Sister Anne Marie. Last night. I said, Sister Anne Marie. There is many prophets in a Jamaica. Them start out in a young world. But when them get bush, they start seeing tight up rope. And I said to her, Sister Anne Marie, you take a little bit of time. No I make some design. And God tell me, say, you are not the people prophet. You are liar.
Mark, M-A-R-K. Glory be to God, you have a family relative. By the name of Mark, there is a witch, a woman, a witch, that's trying to kill Mark when he is sleeping, right in and sleep. Want to kill Mark. Glory be to God. Let me tell you something. Lady, who are you of Mark? Try 
Kaya kita play sa proper land, don't give me a job. Drop you. Amen. 
is is a leash surrounding in the atmosphere operating in human form witchcraft too. Somebody praise the name of the Lord. Mother mean blood and send your children as ancient to seek blood to bring back to the earth. 